Hey everybody, welcome back to Jimmy is Promo, and today we're going to take a look at the latest software update for Samsung One UI 6.0 with Android 14, and this is Beta 4. Now, the last beta update that we just got done doing was actually just one week ago on September 14th. Now, this one did mention that it came with a new feature inside of the video player, even though that was already sitting there from before. I also showed off several other things that it actually never even mentioned in this little change log. So if you're curious on beta three, I'll place that video below this one inside the description. You guys can take a look at that one. This one was a fairly large update. It was right around 1.3 gigabytes. It still gave you that September 1st patch. Now this one is quite a bit smaller. This one ends in ZWIB and the bugs that have been fixed is the fixed reset issue during AP power type setting when using Wi-Fi AP that supports six gigahertz. Now again, along with Samsung One UI 6.0 with Android 14, you actually have this option here again that you're able to choose applications to update along with this. Now it doesn't mean that all of them will be doing an update, but if there's any of them that you love the version currently, you can actually just deselect it and then update them later. Now this one's going to come in at a size of 391 megabytes, still again with that September 1st patch. Now I already went through and I wrote down about four or five different applications from Samsung to see if they would change with this update just to see if we can find anything else other than what is written here. So we're just going to go through, we're going to get this thing downloaded and then once it turns right back on, we'll take a look to see if there is anything newer that we're able to find that isn't listed here. Uh, and then also too, if there is something that I find out, you know, during the day tomorrow or the next day that something is new with this update, I'll come back if it's something that is video worthy. But it's usually at this point in the video that I like to state that if you're brand new here at the channel, Jimmy is promo. We appreciate these tips, tricks, tutorials, and the latest information on your Samsung Galaxy devices. Make sure you send that subscribe button as well as the bell for notifications so you get notified for all future videos. Now, a question I get all the time is when will this officially launch as the normal official stable version for everybody? and it's not during beta. So my guess is that this will officially be done during the month of October, which is kind of crazy. That's the exact same month that Google plans to have Android 14 being finished even with the Pixel devices. Here we are in the month of September. Theirs is not done completely just yet. So I think that Samsung and Google and everybody's gonna come off almost the same time, sometime around October. Uh, again, this one is beta four, and this one originally launched in beta back on August 11th. So now that the update is done and complete, how about we go through, take a look at a few different Samsung applications and features just to see if anything has been changed or newer versions. So first off, we'll take a look at Samsung One UI Home. Now, originally before this update, this one was sitting at 15.0.0.1. 142. So it looks as if we're sitting at the exact same version there. Next up, we'll just take a look at the camera to see if we can find again any newer versions. So inside of camera before this update, it was 14.0.0.0.62. Looks as if we're still at 14.0.0.0.62. So same version there for the camera. Now next up will be the gallery. So we'll see if there's anything new with the gallery here. Sometimes they do make a little bit of changes. Now this one originally was sitting at 15.0.0.0.25. Looks as if the exact same here, version 15.0.0.0.25. And then we're gonna take a look inside of Samsung Internet. So these ones are just chosen out of whim, just randomly chosen to see if there's anything newer. Uh, this one started as 22.0.6.9. 22069. So it looks as if that there is nothing new in terms of those random applications that I took a look at. But yeah, if you were running into any problems or issues, it looks as if we do have a small little hot fix. And that's pretty much all I'm going to call this one is just a little hot fix. I don't really see anything coming through. Uh, there's actually nothing stated for newer features. Again, the last update that we just did here was September 20th. The one before this was a larger one at 1.3 gig. That was six days ago. This one's only at 391 megabytes. So I wasn't able to find anything unless if you're doing any Thing with the Wi-Fi AP that supports six gigahertz. So at least we're getting a little bit closer. Evidently, whatever this problem was, it was something that was a pretty big issue that they needed to put off a little hot fix and not throw anything else with it. But uh, I guess we'll just wait to see sometime during October if the full official launch will come out because this one here is beta four, uh, officially originally started doing the beta on August 11th. So there's really nothing much with this update for me to show you guys here in this video. If I find something else, I will shoot another video if it's video worthy. It's pretty late already at 10.26, almost 10.30 at night. Don't really have time to really play with this and dig deep. 
Got another video to do, so I'm gonna pop over to that one. So hopefully you guys appreciated this video. I'm just keeping you guys updated with what is going on with the beta program. And if you guys appreciate this, give this thing a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left-hand side. And if you like this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later. <laughs>